from like age four, like mom just being home a lot more than dad. I can remember that. And then dad would come home late and I would usually wait for him. I can remember dad moving out to the apartments and mom saying he's gonna live there for now and we can go visit him on the weekends. Well, and it wasn't even that. It was like, well, g well you can go out to dinner with him and stuff. So like constantly having to go from house to house was really weird. You would have to bring everything with you. Luckily, we would have like toothbrushes and hairbrushes at each house. But like if I wanted to wear a certain shirt the next day, I actually had to think about it the day before and bring it with me. Or if I needed something from one house, I had to bring it with me and if I forgot it then it was sort of one of those things where you go sorry that sucks you can get it tomorrow like I felt like we've always had to like communicate for them I mean I know it's gotten even worse closer in these years than it has been in the past but I still feel like communicating for them has been really stupid I don't I don't like doing that. Or our school friends from St. Therese, I know that they definitely, most of them did not understand what it was like to have to travel from houses. If you would forget your homework at one house, you were kind of screwed. You didn't, it sucked. And most of them did not understand like what you had to deal with. Like if you said, I forgot my homework at my dad's house, they were like, well, why couldn't you go get it? And it's like, because he lives 30 minutes away. It's not that diff it's not that easy. I can't drive 30 minutes in the morning just to go get my homework. It definitely helped us grow up faster. Um, it gave us a s different sort of outlook on life, I'd say, that maybe some kids didn't have. We definitely didn't have as much money as other people because money was being split around between households and I definitely feel like that changed our perspective on um, growing up and on life and how to do things and things of that sort. Like I definitely feel like I want to work on not being in debt after college because of everything that mom's gone through and it's mm -hmm. helped me realize like what I need to do for my life. I go hang out with friends. <coughs> um, I, they help me like push through the situations. They help me talk about everything that's going on. It makes it easier because I don't have to discuss my problems with the parents. I can discuss my problems with my friends. And art helps me with my stress and anxiety by concentrating on something else other than said stress and anxiety. If our parents were still getting together, I feel like there would still be problems going on. Mm -hmm. I feel like it would still be a stressful situation for all of us and I don't want them to have stayed together just for us. I think that would have caused more issues in our life than it already has and so I don't think it would have been a smart idea. I think it was probably for the best that they did get divorced.